We've been doing a lot of these odd jobs. We found a few like hidden secrets, which actually reminds me. We should look at our new uh, treasure map, shouldn't we? I don't think we've even looked at this. We found that other treasure. It took us a little while. Oh, we okay. This is the one that we found in the house, but we didn't have the map for. So this is out by. I think this is by Seth, if I'm not mistaken. If I'm not mistaken, right? Which is pretty cool. It's pretty cool. So we'll check this out today. And, uh, I guess that means we should probably just head out to where Seth is. Let me just double check that I'm not crazy here. Yeah, it's this little, it, I think it's this actual house right here. That we had found it in. And Seth is chilling out in this area. So, is there anything we could do, like, along the way? Or maybe I should just jump over there. Do that kind of thing. So yeah. Uh, Falstro, thanks for setting up this command. Uh, just so that you guys know, since there are a lot of subs gifted on this channel. That's, first of all, really kind. Second of all, um, Twitch is celebrating September, So any sub gifted in the month of September can be extended for another month for just a buck. So if you get a sub gifted to you, you can uh, renew it for one dollar. <laughs> And then the broadcaster gets the full benefits. Which is really nice of Twitch, actually. So yeah, real quick shoutouts, guys. Uh, Mr. Petri, thanks for the brand new sub. Uh, Grumpage, thanks for the 12 months. Farut Suzu, thanks for the 2 months. Club DJ, thanks for the 3. And Jacko UK, thanks for the brand new Prime sub, dude. Appreciate that. Uh, Sir Morkai says, if you watch Jack Ryan on Amazon Prime as a Prime user, you can get 400 bits on the 7th of September? Really? Oh, that's interesting. That's really weird. I've had Jack Ryan recommended to me so many times. Honest to God. Somebody messaged me this morning on Twitter and said, Hey, I started watching um, Sharp Objects on your recommendation. And episode one is a snooze fest. <laughs> I was like, what? You're crazy. I told him to keep watching because it's really good. Maybe we'll take this bounty and hopefully that leads us out um, in that direction. Perry Rose, 160 bucks. Now we're talking. Assault at Mascalero. All right. Bounty target was last seen near Mascalero. Let's check out where this is. Oh, this is actually. Oh wait, hold on. <laughs> this is not, this is not at all in the right direction. But, not to fret, we're gonna do this first. I'm a bit concerned because I like to get, I like to get a little bit warmed up, you know? I like to get in the zone a little bit before we head out. But we'll see how we do. Hey, Soul Empress, thanks. I'm glad you're watching. Thank you. How's everybody doing? I know Alora is sick. Other than that, it seems like everybody's doing great. It's your first stream too, Cradle? Thanks, guys. It's so cool that you guys are coming out. Thanks for coming to say hi. Part of me really likes riding around at night. Um, but we spent the majority of the last many hours in the dark. I feel like maybe after this bounty, what we'll do is, uh, we'll rest if not enough time has passed. And we'll try to, um, run around in the daytime for a while. Well, that's a good point. I actually still have an outstanding bounty that I should try and fix up. I should pay it off. I have that, uh, deed? Is that what it's called? It's not that expensive though. I think our bounty is like, where do I see it? 70 bucks? It could be worse. But I should pay it, you're right. I have to take it to like a telegrams office or something. Go. 
You're wondering the name of the city that I live in? It's, uh, I live near Montreal. Okay, 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 okay. Now, we want to capture this dude if we can. Let's get reloaded here. I don't have a ton of bullets, so I might have to buy some new, some more ammo. I also need to make sure that I know which is the actual target and which ones I can just kill in cold blood. If I come down here, do I have any good cover? Yeah, I do. Oh, check this out. This is beautiful. Whoops. Nothing like killing cowboys in the morning. Oh, I don't think so, buddy. Come on now. Is he gonna go crazy on me here? Don't you dare get on that horse. Oh! Got him. Oh, this never gets old. This is legit. Oh, I ain't got any good news for you, friend. Well, well, what are you doing? Easy. It's nice to see the bounty prices are escalating. We'll return this guy to where he belongs. Keep quiet now. Oh boy. Oh, okay. What the hell? I should actually try and get some of the stuff from these guys that. Let me try and grab some of these guys here. I need more than By grab, I mean loot. There's like a pile of bodies here that we can check real quick. Is there any chance that his uh, that he can like escape? Will our horse come to us with him on there? No. All right. This might be pretty risky. Then. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know that could happen. I don't think. All right, let's get out of here. We got some ammo, we got some money. Let's not get too greedy. Wrong horse. But that's cool. Big mistake, hombre. Big. Yeah. I think I'm gonna mark this. So we have a clear way out of here. Oh, we actually have to take him way up here. Which is fine because... Oh no, actually... Can we clear our bounty there? I'll find it when I get there, I guess. Oh no. Oh no. Come on. 
I thought we were going down for sure. I'm a dumb bounty hunter. Who's tied up in the back of the horse? Yeah, that's what I thought. So is it like his goons or whatever that are following me? He doesn't fall off because I'm a really good rope tire. That's why. Much appreciate. Falstro, thanks for gifting all those subs again, dude. Thank you so much, man. That's really generous. Thank you, buddy. I hope you guys enjoy those. Zombies, Mimo, Cradle Robin, Setog, and Lord Blaine. Uh, Perky Nihilus, thanks for the Prime sub. Peregrine, thanks for the seven months as well. Thanks, guys. Okay, now... Can I pay off my bounty here? Oh, hold on. I gotta go get this guy's horse. Whoa, oh, oh. whoa. Sorry, guys. I got this. Come with me. Quick, away from the wolves. Jesus. Get off of it. Get away from me. Watch them kill that horse. Over here. Lassoing stuff is so satisfying. You'll pray for me. Well. Well, that's generous. Thank you. <laughs> you could drop the R, I'd be happy. You were somewhat known around the frontier. It now costs you significantly less to convince officers of the law to turn a blind eye. Okay. Now, real question. Where can I... Can, where can I pay off my bounty in this area? Raven, thanks for gifting a bunch of subs as well. Serial Killer, Underdog Warrior, Brua, and Lean himself. Thank you for doing that, you guys. And Soul Empress, thanks for the new sub also. By the train tracks. Is that a place I can see? Oh, is that like, uh, over in this area? Uh, where are you going? Can I pay it off in here? Not so fast, partner. I don't think so. Bonnie McFarlane is just as capable as any of her brothers could have ever been. Maybe only during the daytime? Or do I have to go to that one spot? This certainly doesn't look like I can do it here. I'll head back to the place that I know. We could head back over here, and then we could pay it at this, uh, this little symbol. Right? Let's go! 
will take a shortcut. Trust me, I know this shortcut very well. That one opens up during the daytime? Okay, gotcha. Thanks. Whoa. Social club challenge. You need to be signed into social club to complete this challenge? I'm pretty sure we've cleared out this basin like twice now. Come on. Remember how I told you guys that I knew this shortcut really well? Well, that was a lie. <laughs> that, was, that was totally untrue. But that's fine. I don't have time to camp? Is that because I'm near this thing? Surely I can camp here. What the hell? Is that because of that social challenge? Ah, here we go, I bet. Nailed it. I'm not willing to sacrifice my horse <coughs> for a fall, you know? Armadillo! Let's go to Armadillo! <laughs> so for coffee today, I don't have a McCafe. Uh, Aram has been talking about pumpkin spice lattes. And so today I decided to try one of those. Half sweet. No whip. And it's quite good. Okay, so this is a telegraph. The icon's not here though. What's going on? Is this guy closed all of a sudden? Wait, hold on. Maybe I'm just in the wrong spot. No, it should be this guy, no? Howdy. No dice. Yo, I'm he I want to pay my bounty. <laughs> like, really bad. Do I ever drink black coffee? Yeah, that's, that's what I normally drink. Hey, what's up, Pietro? Or Pietro, I imagine. Okay, well, I guess I'm not paying my bounty. So now we could start heading out to uh, here, near Seth. And we'll check out that treasure, which we know exactly where it is, so... Hey Breeze, what's up, buddy? I think while we're in town, let's maybe check out some of the stuff we can buy. We'll go to the gun store and we'll go to the general store. My mistake, sir. You won't find anything. Okay, so rabbit's foot we have. Uh, I don't think we need any of these really. Although we do finally have some cash. Sales wise, anything else I can do for you? We have a bunch of these to get rid of. I'm really hoping that there's not a way that we can straight up lose our money. I wonder if we get, like, arrested or something because of this bounty. If that would be... if we would lose cash somehow. Okay. That is a lot of cashola.
Do you guys know why I can't pay my bounty in that place? Hello there. All right, what do you have going on that I might want to buy? I think some repeater ammo. I'll just take all of it. Wait, what is this? Sniper rifle ammo? What? Where? I should buy this. Doubles ammo capacity on rifles and repeaters. I think that's just like a... I don't have to equip it or anything, right? I don't know how I'm going to get a sniper rifle, but that is what I want. Maybe they only take credit card. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, maybe. It is really weird, though, isn't it? There is another place that I know of that we can... Uh, that we've done this before. Was it here? I want to say it was here. Carry on. Okay. Sorry, mister. Whoops. I will actually buy that pistol, I guess, as an upgrade. Maybe what we'll do is anytime these, uh, anytime a new weapon's available, we'll just buy it. Let me actually buy all of this as well. Alright. Oh, I guess I don't even have the bounty. How- why did the bounty go away? That is so weird! Maybe that's something I don't understand yet. But that's absolutely why I can't pay it off, because it doesn't exist anymore. Oh, we did check it earlier. Oh, it's because my honor went up, so that so I don't have a bounty. Whoa. Okay. Fame went up, bounty went down. I know it said like the cops would turn more of a blind eye, so that's I guess what erased it. Cool. Let's go. All right. Let's go see Seth. And the treasure house. Maybe as a quick review as well, uh, we can take a look at some of these challenges. So rabbits, desert sage, and deer. Not buck. Deer. I think part of your bounty hunter money paid off your bounty? I think it's the fame thing. A little bit late on helping the guy. I was honestly so paranoid that I was gonna shoot another officer. You never freaking know out here. Forgive me, friend. That's how I got my bounties in the first place, I think. Just trying to be too helpful. It's like nice guy tax. Well. What's yours is mine. Where did my horse run off to? Like, what is she thinking right now? Yeah. I almost- I, I did almost feed a cannibal, but to be fair... Uh... What the... To be fair, I didn't. You're right. That almost happened. <laughs> Come on. 
Foxtrot 4-0. What an appropriate name. How are you, dude? I would love for like a cruise control system on this horse with like lane guidance. Yeah, and like the Witcher 3 horse piloting system is pretty good. Absolutely. Sorry to scare you there, Foxtrot. Yeah. Isn't it nice to be out here in the daytime? Gang, hideout is deserted at the moment. Oh. A gang here at some point. Is this that helps? Yeah, it is. Okay, so we know exactly where this treasure is. I'm, I'm, I'm presuming that I've picked the right house here. I know there was like a cellar entry. Yeah, here it is. Right here. We are legit treasure hunters now. That's what, three? That we found? With varying degrees of uh, my luck's turn. ease and success. <laughs> okay, so we got some gold. And then we'll have a new treasure map, I guess, right? More fame. So if you get like completely famous, can you just kind of get away with doing anything you want? Is that how that works? Okay. Rio del Toro. There's a tree. With some rock walls. And then it's out in front of like the broken rock wall space. Rio del Toro, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure we've seen that on the map somewhere. Hmm. There's Rio Bravo. We'll keep an eye out for it in our in our travels. But for now, let's go talk to Seth. Hey, Julie, what's up? How are you? Were you at uh, PAX? I think I saw you putting some pictures up. I think it was PAX, right? Was that your first time going to one of those events? Come on. I was telling Aram last night, next year I'd like to start going to some conventions. I've never been to one. Up. Look who it is! Oh, it's like that, is it? Huh? Not talking to Seth today? Oh, <laughs> the old silent treatment. <laughs> oh, whoa. Ah, that's quite a stench. Hey, Seth. Oh. Oh. Seth, come back here. Oh, hey, partner. I was just looking for you. Looking for me? What? Over there? Uh, how you doing? I'm good. Well, uh, 
See you later, partner. Where you going, partner? <laughs> Nowhere. <laughs> okay. You know damn right that's Nowhere not true. Nowhere wouldn't happen to be where that thing you're looking for is kept, would it? No, sir. <laughs> no, sir. Come on, partner. <laughs> okay, I was just uh, fooling. <laughs> partner, uh, you know, the thought of that treasure does funny things to me. I wonder if this treasure According even to exists. The map, it's somewhere in that big abandoned house. Wait. The house we were literally just at? Yo, Seth, I've been through this house like four times, man. I'm pretty sure that it's empty at this point. What the, the shit? Me here. This is that look I figured they must be with you. I like him better dead. I like him better dead too. You know how this is gonna end. Oh! Right in the noggin. I can't see him. Is he in that house? I dare you. Oh, he's blind firing. Oh, I'm pretty sure getting shot in the neck would kill you. Maybe not. Don't leave any alive. Okay, Seth. There's still another one up at the. Oh, there's a whole shitload. I'm a rebel without a cause. Oh! Go on. So it is the time. same place. You gotta find the treasure for me, please. Oh, uh, man. you mean that? <laughs> was it underneath what like one I of those say, skull partner? things? You discovered the treasure hunter outfit. It'll allow you to be treated like one of their gang in Gaptooth Ridge. You gotta go now. It's our last chance. Okay, I'm trying to get up these stairs. It's locked. Let's try around the back. <laughs> it's the same place! That's funny. We're in luck. Uh. I don't think so. This might have been a bad move. Don't let him get my treasure, mister! I don't even know what I'm looking for here. I guess I gotta go up? What'd that meant to be? Whoops. Do something, mister! They're gonna take my treasure! What the That's it, Smoke him! Lily liver goat! You might as well give up now! Hey! Whoa, he's huge! Whoa! He explodes. Kill them all, mister! I'll bet you all down! Sorry, partner. Got him. Just drop the gun. It ain't worth it.
I think I found your treasure. Yee-hoo! That wasn't here before. Finally, I see the light at the end of this very long, long tunnel. <laughs> Seth's gonna be rich after all these years. <laughs> <laughs> it's silk sheets and Parisian whores from now on, mister! <laughs> See you soon, Tante. Uh, it's not necessarily God like the VAX system, this? in that you can't target specific Black body parts. It just constantly sure targets whatever your cursor's on. It very much. <laughs> stupid liars! Those stupid chicken shit maps! Make it a damn fool of me. A glass eye! <laughs> it's a glass eye! Stop with the tears and help me with Williamson's gang. Seriously. And you can come up with another excuse to go exhume one of your old friends. Uh oh. Hunting dead man's treasure ain't done me no favors. Sure. Sure. I'm ready for the living. I'll see you and Mr. West Dickens over at Fort Mercer when you gentlemen is ready. Treasure hunter outfit menu entry added. So just like that, he's given up on hunting treasure. He's starting to realize it's not really working out. Fair enough. Forgive me, friend. Does the glass eye have any significance to anything? If it's if it's like spoiler related, don't tell me. But I'm just wondering if it's about anything that's happened so far. I don't think so. Someone treasured it, obviously. Yeah. I can't recall when we searched this place um, previously if this is the place where we had the empty treasure. Because it's possible. What's up, Alpha? How are you, man? Okay. So it looks like we're done with Seth, and now we're gonna do some jobs for, uh, Dickens and that other guy. Where are they looking at from here? Dickens is down here. We can go back to Armadillo for Irish, so maybe let's, let's go to Dickens next. And along the way, and I'm totally open to you guys helping with a specific aspect of these treasures. If we see this Rio del Toro area, feel free to yell at me that we see it. Rio del Toro. Come on. Whoa there. Pop it. Thanks, Akko. That's helpful. As always. <laughs> Real Bravo. Hey, Marta, what's up? Come on. Come on. Uh, have we been to this area at all before? Oh, well, how could I not? Oh, you sons of bitches. I'm getting- oh, I'm getting ambushed by a whole bunch of shit. Oh, 
What the shit? Bob Bobcats and bandits. She set me up. She set me up. Come here. Oh, he's gone. Oh, you! 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 Hold on. Where do you think you're going? The son of a bitch. Get over here. What was that about? What was that about? You're coming with me. If she wasn't in on it, she wouldn't be running. <laughs> in my opinion. So you're gonna just come with us for a while. We'll see what we do with you. You get smelly in. <laughs> Maybe we will put her on the tracks. I'm kind of feeling like she deserves it. We, have any, we don't have any tracks nearby. Uh, we could head down here. Looks like, actually, I wonder if we could cut off the train at this at this section. She almost got me killed. I don't know if the bobcat was on their side. Or it was just really unfortunate timing. Let's make sure the train's going in that direction. Oh wait, it's not going in that direction. Son of a bitch. See where it's at. Oh, it went the other way. Son of a... <laughs> Alright. Well, we'll just keep her with us as collateral for whatever we want later, I guess. I'm sure something will come up. At any rate, she's gonna learn her lesson. Can you put people in the rivers? Oh, I don't know. Probably. Plain view. I don't know that we've been out here before. I don't recognize these things. Nigel, I brought you a present. <laughs> Mr. Marston, sir. John Marston! Mr. Marston, don't be so childish. Come on, sir, I implore you. Okay, okay, okay. So I made a few innocent mistakes when last we met. Innocent mistakes? But my plan is still sound. Together we can conquer, if not the world, then certainly Bill Williamson. But first, you need me to do you a favor? <laughs> you read my mind. I can only deduce you've been taking my tonic, sir, as instructed. It can give the most <laughs> ordinary of intelligences a remarkable insight. I'll give you insight. I'll show you what your guts look like. Oh, Please, sir, okay. this show of petulance is nothing short of embarrassing. Think for a moment, sir. Think. I'm thinking about how much of my time you're wasting. <laughs> At least he's finally saying sir, it. 
Sir, I am about to do something which I greatly discourage in all wise and rational men. A selfless act for you. But, sir, before I act selflessly, allow me to act selfishly and sell some of my wares. Fair enough. Oh, good, sir. Come, and let's go visit some of our fine friends in the other oil business we have here in Plainview. These men need all the help they can get. <laughs> <laughs> He's got this weird, like, bumbling about him. Like, he's always just, he's very bouncy in everything that he does. His walk, his talk, everything. It's just like this weird, bouncy creepiness. Ladies and gentlemen, gather round, gather round. My friends, are you ready to change your lives forever? Oh, yeah, give me some friends, of that tonic. Hardworking souls of uh, Plainview, do you suffer from rheumatism, lumbago, acute chronic sciatic, uh, neurologic, or inflammatory pain? Well, I represent the only company that makes the genuine article which cures headache, neuralgia, uh, toothache, earache, backache, twelve... This man is a fucking charlatan. Oh. He just got done swindling us down at Chose Springs with this song and dance. <laughs> I say we tar and feather him right now. I nah. say we shoot the uh, bastard. I think it's time we take our business elsewhere. Uh, I apologize if science is not uh -oh. your forte. Good day, one and all. Somebody get that thief back! Whoa! I think it's time we relocate our business, guys. Come on, Tom. I'm not waiting here much longer. St. Homobonus is not looking down on me favorably. Who? Homobonus! I'd say he's doing me here just to search. Those infants were clearly informed. It's also known as riding shotgun. Well, you can only shit on people for so long. Let's do it. It's their turn to pull down the pan. A crude metaphor in every sense of the word, my dear boy. You need the business to me. Do I try to tell you how to rob banks? Oh, robbing banks felt more honest. Wow. Yeah, these guys aren't going to be touching us. Supposed to be protecting me. What do you think I'm doing? The most legitimate riding shotgun I've ever done. Oh my god. How does this guy not die? Oh boy. Sure is lucky you came along and did. Lucky for who? Two shotgun blasts he can take. Can't we talk about this? All these horses with no owners. Well, it looks like the global expansion of the West Dickens elixir might have come across. You can shoot crates of TNT to set them off. Look to the front, John! Oh! It's clear! Let's push on to Koi Vaseka! What do these numbskulls expect? Miracles? Well, that's about what you've been promising them! Do I have a legendary horse yet? No. I have the war horse that we got. Uh, but I haven't purchased a horse yet. For a man of the people, you sure ain't very popular. I am up against the weight of people. Uh, maybe you should keep going. 
Now what are you gonna do? Maybe you need to think about a change of career. I will never give up on science, John. There's nothing more satisfying than, like, blowing somebody off their horse. How can these people harbor such bitterness? Well, I ain't surprised. That tonic I drank at Ridgewood went through me like a dose of salt. Holy moly, Zcas. Thank you guys so much for uh, all of the sub gifting. That's incredible. Thank you. That's super nice. Thank you. I hope that the new guys getting them appreciate that. Good shot. Keep that gun at the ready, my dear boy. Uh, obviously. Just keep driving. Can you go any faster, though? Snipe? Yes, you got him. Do you want to die? Hard right. Oh, I'm sorry, Dickens. We'll give you some of that tonic and you'll be better than ever. Uh, M6D TDSK. Game up 2K. Proton, Blue Gaton, Bradley. You're all sub to the channel now. Hope you enjoy it. Thanks for doing that, Zcas. Hey, you're welcome, Sassy. Well, that was a little hairy. Thank you, my dear boy. You saved the day again. This guy would be dead without us. No question. Me with the speed with which a group of men can turn from passive sheep into murderous wolves. I'm impressed with how you nearly got us killed back there. Uh, yes, uh, perhaps we should shell the tonics business for a period. You think? Let's say we try our hand at racing again. <laughs> There's a meet at Rathskeller. You're trying my patience, Mr. West Dickens. Well, I'm sorry, dear boy, but I'm only an aging vendor of exotic elixirs, not the bloody U.S. Cavalry. Forgive me if matters take some time to prepare. All right. Oh, we can actually just do some. Are you shitting me? Crazy animal! Get on the way, horse. We make they just come in and attack and run off. Like, what is up? Mr. West Dickens. Ah, Mr. Marston. How wonderful to see you, sir. How wonderful. Are we ready, then? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, nearly, sir. Barely nearly, sir. I just need some cash to get some extra hardware fitted to my old Trojan horse here. Of course. You, you what? <laughs> Never mind, sir. I can only presume that you have not enjoyed the benefits of a classical education, so I will not take umbrage if some of my illusions sail over your head, sir. I won't pretend to understand you, but I will endeavor to make you understand me. <laughs> Either we do this right now, or I put a bullet in you and get on with my day. Please, I knew you were a violent man, Mr. Marston, but I did not think you were a stupid one. We need money to outfit my carriage, to turn a we? simple tradesman's vehicle into something more subterfuge. <laughs> and I'm about to tell you how we are going to gain said cash. Now I know that you ride very well. So come, sir, to Rathskeller Fork. <laughs> Follow me, John. It's not too far to Rathskeller Fork. I can't, well, I can't just ride with you? Like what? Come on. We're getting ripped off. So how are you, John? 
Okay, all things considered, hopefully we can get through today without running into another army of your satisfied customers. Onwards and upwards! I refuse to let the blind stupidity of the proletariat derail my calling in life. Nothing blind about it. I'd say they saw right through you. Ah, before yeah, our prisoner escaped, down. I'm going to imagine. Yeah, boy. I'm not sure what's going on there. Crooked as a dog's hind leg, Wes Dickens. I resent that implication, John. <laughs> I wasn't implying. I was telling. If you're such a successful businessman, what are you doing living in a cave? Delightfully Dickensian, isn't it? If you say so. Are you familiar with the concept of philanthropy, John? I'm surprised you are. Oh, I don't do any of this for myself, John. I hope you realize that. You're crazy, old man. You seem to be forgetting that I've been part of your ridiculous charade. It's been quite a ride, John, hasn't I'm it? I'm pot we committed now. That far. No, I mean us. Bridgewood Farm. Gap Tooth Breach. Find you. We make quite a team, you and me. Brains and brawn. We should consider a more permanent partnership. This partnership ends as soon as I have Bill Williams. <laughs> there I appreciate we go. your help, but I've just about had it with all your schemes. You need to realize what's at stake here. I know, John, I know. Just win this race and we'll be ready. I give you my word. I think we've had his word a few times now, but yeah, I'm sure this one will be different. I really believe him this time. There it is, John. Rathskeller Fork. Riding in. Okay. Come on, easy up there. Is this my war horse? I think it is, eh? This is my last job for you, Dickens. Last one. No shooting, stabbing. Cliff pushing, rock throwing, cactus grinding, neck lassoing, setting fires, or other acts that causes a rider to unfairly lose his weight, or bleed heavily, or black out. Get yourselves ready. Set. Go. Whoa. Let's go. Just like that. Nice try, mister. Yeah. Yeah. Focused. Seems to me in this partnership I'm doing, well, all of the work. As long as I don't fall off a cliff or something, we're looking alright right now.
Easy. We nailed it. He saw, he conquered. <laughs> what a fantastic spectacle, John. Let's take a moment to bask in the glory of our victory. Have we got enough money now? All right, all right, all right. Uh, yes, once Seth and Irish have furnished their side of the bargain, I think we should be ready. Quite a team we've assembled, don't you think? A bunko, a grave robber, and a drunk. How could things possibly go wrong? <laughs> I love these people that we've met up with. Like, how do we get involved in this freaking group? All right. Not bad. Not bad. Let's see what this guy needs over here, eh? We are super famous. Blackjack! Ooh! There is Blackjack. Why don't we check that out? We played poker before. Somebody had mentioned Blackjack earlier, but it wasn't available to us. Yeah, get me in there. I'm real clumsy. Sorry, mister. You don't want me to deal? <laughs> okay, fine. I'll play the game. Yeah. Let's see how much luck is. around these parts has been seen beating women folk. All right. Every hand requires a bet. In the next round, you can double your bet if the hand warns. Yeah, okay. I know. We know the rules. We know the rules. It'll have a minimum bet of two and a maximum bet of ten. I heard the gang of twin rocks is in cahoots with Marshall Johnson. The goal is to total 21 without going over. Face cards are worth 10. Yeah. When you're comfortable with the value of your hand, you can stand. What do we have there? Why are we showing our cards? <laughs> I guess... Oh, yeah. Okay, fine. I guess it doesn't matter. Everyone shows their cards. Fine. We just have to be the dealer's hand. Look at your hand closer with right trigger. Is that a three? Yeah, okay, we're good. Uh... Let's double down. Double down for me. Oh, we're only dealt one more card? I didn't know how that worked. But fine. Hit me. Marshall Johnson's up at Pleasant's house. <laughs> Living it up with the other crook. I, am I mean, that's not bad. But that's not great. Oh, bullshit. <laughs> Bulloney. This reeks of fishiness. Okay. 21 for the dealer. This game. That's more like it. All right, I'm going to go again. Hello. 14. Good luck to Kill you. me. You going to poke me with your bottle of the I'll skip to our turn, I think. Has it arrived? I I got a hit on this. Fuck. <sighs> Baloney. My favorite time of day in this hellhole. How much money are we gonna lose here? Hit me. God, what are these hands? Fifteen. Holy. What do you do? No All luck. Right. Don't worry. Don't worry. Our luck's turn around here. No, it isn't. Don't take my card now. Hit. There. Stick. You want a good time? They'll probably have an ace or another face card too. That's the worst part about this whole situation. Okay, yeah, hit. Oh, you gotta be shit. You got some luck, mister. <laughs> this is funny. What? No, I don't think you stay on 15. I think you hit on 15, you stay on 16, generally. That giant lion out of Hennigan's stead, it's being protected by local ingrates. I'm gonna pulp that pretty face of yours. God. Okay, 20. I'll stand. You can brand me like a steer anytime. You? Is this, are we getting ripped off here? The way you shoot, you more are we getting ripped off right now? Good. You're in. Something's fishy. Hmm. 
This should be fun. They say Marshall oh, Johnson's fairy yeah. stolen goods One out of Rio Del Lobo. Oh, God. Oh, really? Yeah, I remember that from when I first made it up. 18. Why, hello. If he has a face card. I stay. All right. Oh, wow. It can happen. I'm out of here. This, this reeks of cheating. This reeks of cheating. No. Blackjack game is full shit. Somebody's crying.